Hello and welcome to this special multiplayer DVD version of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Your chance to try your luck in that famous hot seat and compete against your family or friends to be the first to reach the magical million pound mark and the chance, of course, to win a family holiday to Universal Mediterranea. Now, all you need is your DVD remote control. You can move around the screen and make your choices by using the up, down, left, right and enter buttons. It really couldn't be simpler. Right, if you're ready, Let's play. Right, here we go. Let's go over the rules, although I'm sure you're familiar with them all by now. You are 15 correct answers away from winning a virtual million pounds. Now, as always, you can walk away at any time. And if you do get stuck, then you have the usual three lifelines. There's 50-50. You can phone a friend. Or, of course, you can ask the audience. OK, if you're ready, all you need to do now is select the number of players and we can play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Right, you have 15 questions and three lifelines. The very best of luck. Let's play. OK, for 100 quid, here's question number one. Well played, that's correct. Have a look at question number two. It's worth 200 quid. You're absolutely correct. Well played. Here's question number three. It's worth £300. Right, you've decided to ask the audience. Now, let's hope they can help. Audience, on your keypads, please. All vote now. Jolly good, it's the right answer. Remember, a wrong answer here and you will leave with nothing. I'm sure that won't happen. Question number four. That's absolutely correct, well played. Now, get the next question correct, and you'll leave with at least a thousand pounds. Good luck. Here comes question number five. Absolutely spot on. Well done. You've reached the first milestone. That's one thousand pounds. Now, have a look at question six, because it could double your money to two thousand. What is the name of the 16-ton bell in St Paul's Cathedral? Great Paul, Great Tom, Great Christopher, or Great Charles? That's great, it's the right answer. Here comes question number seven out of a possible 15. It's worth 4,000 pounds. Good luck. Oksana Fedorova stepped down from which position early in 2002? PM of Lithuania, head of Sony, Miss Universe, manager of AC Milan. It's absolutely correct. Well done. OK, if you choose the right answer to the next question, you can double your money to £8,000. Let's have a look at question 8 of 15. In which English city is the Jane Austen Centre? Winchester, Wells, Bath or Gloucester? Well played, you're absolutely right. Right, the jumps are starting to get a lot bigger now. Here is question nine for a possible £16,000. 
In Greek mythology, on what did Iris travel to get to Earth? Rainbow, rain cloud, thunderbolt, or snowflake? Don't let anyone else put ideas in your head. Okay, let's phone a friend. Now, who do you think might be able to help you choose the right answer? Goodness, I thought you would have known that. The answer is A. I'm certain of that. Go for A. Absolutely spot on. Well done. Okay, this is where the drops start to get steeper. Get the next question wrong and you lose £15,000. But get it right and you win £32,000 guaranteed. Tassiography is the art of divining the future by what method? Palm reading, handwriting, tea leaves or tarot cards? Congratulations, that's the right answer. Right, question number 11 is worth £64,000. You would still walk away with 32000 even if you got it wrong. But let's hope you don't. Who sang the US National Anthem at the 2004 Super Bowl? Christina Aguilera, Beyonce Knowles, Mariah Carey, Britney Spears. Right, computer, we need a bit of help here. Take two of the answers away and hopefully make things a bit easier. That's the right answer. It's going really well so far. Right, the next question is worth a whopping £125,000. It's number 12 of a possible 15. Take your time, it's a lot of money. Which of the following is not an alien in the teen drama Roswell? Max, Isabel, Liz or Michael? Yes, that's the right answer. Right, now just take your time and relax. The next question is number 13 of a possible 15. If you answer and you're wrong, you drop back to 32,000 pounds. Here's the question for a quarter of a million. Bernard was the first name of which of these military commanders? Montgomery, Rommel, Eisenhower, MacArthur. It's up to you. Remember, you don't have to play. Well played. You're absolutely right. This is now getting very, very serious. You are just two correct answers away from winning one million pounds. But if you give me a wrong answer here, you will lose 218,000 pounds not good. Have a look at question number 14, but think very carefully about what you want to do. Who did not play one of the three main doctors in the film Ghostbusters and its sequel? Rick Moranis, Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd or Harold Ramis? I just remind you, you do not have to play this. You would drop £218,000 if it's wrong. You didn't have to play that, but I bet you're glad you did. It's correct. 
Fantastic. You have played a brilliant game so far, and now you have £500,000. But we would really like to give you one million. Take as long as you need. Here comes the million pound question. Which of the following was a type of men's hat? Fast asleep, snuggle down, wide awake, bushy tailed. I can't believe the tension here. Are you absolutely sure that's your final answer? Well, you could have walked away with half a million pounds. But instead, you'll be walking away with one million pounds. That's the right answer. Fantastic. What a tremendous game. All 15 questions answered correctly. Well done. You are a virtual millionaire. Congratulations. Now, for a chance of jetting off for a fabulous holiday to Universal Mediterranean, all you have to do is write this special win code on the postcard provided and send it to us in the post. It couldn't be easier. Good. Well done and thank you for playing. Who wants to be a millionaire?